our second day of um, this week of prayer and uh, the Warriors Pathfinder Club from North Edmonton SDA Church will be in charge of the program. Hope, I hope and trust everyone will be blessed with the presentation of Message of Hope which is going to be presented. My name is Joyce because I'm the director of Warriors Pathfinder Club. Thank you. Um, in, the, in this program, we have praise and worship, which will be presented by uh, Lisa Mungale, Kezia Samuels, and the Isha Samuels. And after that, we have Pathfinder song, with the same girls, Samuel, the Samuels and the Lisa. And they will have Samuel the, in, in this, uh, who is going to present the Pathfinder Pledge. Lisa Mongale, Pathfinder Law. Opening prayer will be offered by Samuel Ndeze and uh, followed by prayer poem by Lisa Mongale. Scripture reading will be read by Samuel Ndeze and the special song will be offered by Kezia and Isha Samuels. And our prayer devotion will be done by Caleb Ndeze. And the closing prayer, closing song will be Presented by Lisa and the Samuels, and the closing prayer will be offered by Lisa Mongale. Thank you. Good evening, everyone. My name is Kelia, and this is Isha, and we will start off with our first open, uh, our first opening song, which is "Sweet by and By" four to eight. There's a land that is fairer than day, and by faith we can see it afar. For the Father waits over the way to prepare us a dwelling place there. In the sweet by and by, we shall meet on that beautiful shore. In the sweet. meet on that beautiful shore. We shall sing on that beautiful shore. The melodious songs of the blessed, and our spirit shall sorrow no more. Not a sign for the blessings of rest. In the sweet by and by, we shall meet on that beautiful shore. In the sweet To our bountiful Father above, we will offer a tribute of praise for the glorious gift of His love and the blessings that hallow our days. In the sweet by and by, we shall meet on that beautiful shore. In the sweet by and by, we shall meet. Show. Our last song will be I Will Sing of My Redeemer 343. <clears throat> I will sing of my Redeemer and his wondrous love to me. On the cruel cross he suffered from the curse to set me free. Sing, oh, sing of my Redeemer with his blood. I will tell the wondrous story. 
and we will be doing the Pathfinder song. Pathfinder's song, Attention. Oh. We are the Pathfinder strong, the servants of God are we. Faithful as we march along in truth and purity. A message to tell to the world, a truth that will set us free. King Jesus, the Savior, is coming back for you and me. Good evening, Pathfinders, and I will be doing the Pathfinder Pledge. By the grace of God, I will be pure, kind, and true. I will keep the Pathfinder law, and I will be a servant to God and a friend to man. Thank you. Pathfinders, I will be doing the Pathfinder law. The Pathfinder law is for me to keep the morning watch, do my honest part, care for my body, keep a level eye, be courageous and obedient, walk softly in the sanctuary, keep a song in my heart, and go on God's errands. Good evening again, Pathfinders. My name is Samuel, and I will be doing the opening prayer. Pathfinders, prayer attention. Let us pray. Our Father, art in heaven, Lord, we praise you and thank you for this day you've given us. We thank you for giving us the opportunity to come together here, Lord, to participate in this week of prayer, Lord. I pray that you will help not only this day to go well, but the whole week to go well. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. 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 Good evening again, Pathfinders. I will be doing the prayer poem today by Greta Zwan called Prayer's Ability. Prayer in the time of trouble brings peace to the weary soul. Prayer in the time of triumph acknowledges God's in control. Prayer is never irrelevant. It is essential to our life. It's not a crutch which to lean on or to use in times of strife. Prayer is a type of thanksgiving, a greeting to God for his grace. Prayer is the essence of mourning, the fragrance of life to embrace. Prayer is a holy connection, a quiet time at God's feet. In prayer, we acknowledge dependence, a place where God and man can meet. Prayer is the means of sustaining a faith that at times can grow weak. The power of prayer is enriching, uplifting to hear our God speak. It's not an audible message, no finger to write out his plan. But a still small voice known as conscious is God's way of speaking to man. When all other avenues falter, a man's Genuity fails. God and his infinite wisdom is the source of who prevails. Nothing can bring such contentment as spending an hour in prayer. God is a most willing listener and he is eternally there. Amen. Good evening once again, Pathfinders, and I will be doing the scripture reading. The verse is Romans chapter 6, verse 14. It says, for sin shall not have dominion over you, for ye are not under the law, but under grace. May the Lord bless the reading of his word. Um, this evening we will be doing the special music, and it's called Pray On. The army of Judah was paralyzed by fear. When they heard a mighty multitude was quickly drawing near. But as they prayed for deliverance, the victory would begin. For when we call upon the Lord, we summon all of heaven. Pray on, for you are who the Lord is looking for. Pray. Very soon. 
shall win the victory. Pray on. When Daniel faced the lions for worshiping the Lord, it seems there was no hope at all for what would be in store. But when we stand on holy ground, our smallest prayer is heard. Instead of on our circumstance, our eyes are on the Lord. Pray on, for you are who the Lord is looking for. Pray on, for this would tear those mighty strongholds down. Stay Salvation. Salvation is a word that we as humans do not use often on a day-to-day -day basis. Salvation means to preserve or deliver from harm, ruin, or loss. If translated to the Bible, it now takes a new meaning of saving us humans from the consequences of our sin. But the real question is, who gives us salvation? If we take examples of today's wor world, we can find many examples of who give people salvation. An army protects and preserves its country from invasion, or a firefighter saves and rescues people from fire. But even with all these examples, there is no one who can give us salvation, like Jesus Christ. In the Bible, there are many examples of Jesus showing grace and mercy in many different ways. In John 3.16, it states that, For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son, that for whoever believes in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. Even though God, who gave the, his one and only Son to come into the world and die for us, he still shows us mercy today. Now you may be asking, well what now do we benefit from his salvation? Now you may... Well in Romans 6.14, you will find your answer. And it says, For sin shall not be your master, but for you are not under the law, but under grace. Now if we go back to the Bible's definition of salvation, it says that with Jesus' sacrifice on the cross, we have the ultimate salvation, as Jesus carried all our sins and died for us. But as we all know, the story doesn't end there. As the next two days passed, Jesus rose from the grave, and just as he is about to go back to his Father in heaven, he tells his disciples, Peace be unto you. Today we still feel his peace, as going back to Romans 6.14, we are free from living under sin and not get to live the rest of our lives, under the grace and salvation of Jesus Christ. I pray that you have been blessed by this message. Thank you for listening, and God bless you. Good evening again, Pathfinders. We will be doing the closing song, Jesus Saves, song number 340. We have heard a joyful sound. Jesus saves, Jesus saves. Spread the gladness all around. Jesus saves, Jesus saves. Bear the news to every land, climb the seas and cross the waves, onward tis our Lord's command, Jesus saves, Jesus saves, wafted on the rolling tide, Jesus saves, Jesus saves, tell to sinners far and wide, Jesus saves, Jesus saves. Say
Let the nations now rejoice. Jesus saves, Jesus saves. Shout salvation full and free. Highest hills and deepest caves. This our song of victory. Jesus saves, Jesus saves. Amen. Please rise for the closing prayer. Pathfinders, prayer attention. Let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for today. Thank you for getting us all through the day and letting us get here safely. I pray for forgiveness of our sins and I pray that the Holy Spirit may be filled in our hearts so that we may shine our light to others and that we may reflect you. And I thank you for letting us learn about salvation and I pray that we may keep the message in our hearts for the whole day. And I pray that the message is blessed to everyone and that this service is blessed to everyone as well. I pray for healing for everyone in the world and I pray that you may answer all their prayer requests and that you may be with each one of us and that you may protect us and you may guide us in the path that you have selected for us. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen.